Mo, Tinubu might go to jail. Make una help me share this video. Listen to waiting this man talk on how he said that Tinubu has 2,500 pages of criminal record with FBI. This, in fact, this video is coming immediately after Tinubu filed a petition to, to US court to make, make, make the Chicago State University hide his identity or her identity on their certificate, on the certificate where they were issued to Atika Abaka. Make on a listen to waiting this man on how he narrates the possibility of Tinubu going to jail is just very. With the condition Tinubu is giving the US court, I don't think they will. Uh oblige him it's not possible if they are going to disclose anything they must disclose everything that is what will make that uh, judgment valid before anybody how can you tell them to release the document but it's not release the gender i don't understand ah it, it, we don't i don't understand it is not possible i don't even want to go into the nitty-gritty or the implication of what he's saying but I know that no U.S. judge, either magistrate or court or, or high court or, or any court at all in U.S. will oblige Tinubu. They will ask him to give them reasons. This is the preble damage he's talking about. What is it? You can't just come to court and make uh, spurious claims and all that and expect the court to listen to. It's not possible. Like when Atiku was asking for this document, he had to adduce a lot of reasons valid reason that was why the court even agreed to release those documents in the case of tinubu he's talking of irreparable damage irreparable what is that irreparable damage that you know, nobody is aware of so unless he can satisfy that condition the court will not oblige him they are going to release everything because the image of the united states the image of u.s court the image of scholar university is at stake here maybe tinubu think that u.s is nigeria that's why he's doing all these things he thinks that u.s is nigeria Look, there's a limit to infamy. All this uh, cover up, there is a limit to it. There is a limit to it, and that limit is coming home now. Tunubu so, should do well and do the needful. In fact, if he should even resign now, it will do him a lot of good. Because by the time this thing come out to, uh, fully, everything is already known. It's just that they, it has not been officially uh, announced by the court. So if he should resign now, maybe it may even uh, help his case but if you continue to do this cover up at a point in time every, everything we give him that thing that he has been hiding for years will be exposed and that will be too bad for him so all this uh, release this don't release this is he commanding the court it's not possible now some of the things he's doing he's telling the US they're even using it to look at Nigeria so this is the type of thing that happened in Nigerian courts and you want to bring it to the United States. It's not possible. It is not possible. I'm telling you, it is not because everything is at stake here. So if people think that he will cover up and then uh, go ahead with this shenanigan in the US, it's not possible. No matter what he does. When it comes to uh, uh, judiciary, democracy, uh, openness, I think I can give it to the United States. If they could do it to their own former president, Donald Trump, I don't know who is Tunubu. I don't know who is Tunubu here. Because lawyers in the US, they will make reference to it. Uh, journalists, they will make reference to it. They will not ask the court, why are you covering this man? They will ask the uh, CSU, why are you covering this man? And they may not answer. Now, to make matters worse, it has become an embarrassment to Nigerians, both in, in, in Nigeria here and in diaspora. You had uh, callers who call on your program what they are saying about what they have suffered, especially Mr. Big B. What is so? It is it, the embarrassment is, is 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 monumental. Is that what you want us to live with the next four years? Over the years, Tudubu has been employed in so many infamy. From the time he lied about uh, his origin in uh, in uh, Lagos State and all that. So it is this thing that has he, he has been building up in Lagos that he took to Abuja and now he has taken to the United States. So uh, you know when when you continue to be clever by half, at a point in time you will lose uh, you will lose uh, gravity. As it is that two people have lost gravity, all his lives have been exposed. Those things that have been hiding is coming up now.
And what caused this thing? Tunubu caused it himself. He refused to do the needful. Because he told the lie initially. And he had been looking for a way to cover that lie. That was what brought about the Chicago State University Brohaha. He told the lies. If he had known this thing, he wouldn't have started it. Because the constitution did not even say you must be a graduate before you can become president. So because he had told a lie initially. That's why we were trying to cover it. And the thing has now exposed him to a lot of ridicule. So, uh, Tunubu as a person now can never be the same again. If his gender is not what he claimed, let him say it. After all, we have transgender all over the world. I don't know why he's adding his gender. I'm telling you. That is the, that is, in fact, that is the, I don't know how to explain it. That a man will now say the people should not expose his gender. What is wrong about your gender? What is wrong there? If you are not the owner, come out and, and say it. So that all this is will die down. If you don't, the, you you be haunted by this uh, scandal throughout your lifetime. You be haunted by it. You will lose a lot of friends. You will lose a lot of businesses. Nigeria will be worse for it. So the the implication is 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 is, is overwhelming. If Tulubu consider all this the interest of Nigeria, that is why I'm advising. Let him resign to save Nigeria the embarrassment and the shame. He has done enough as it is. No Nigerian president have, have gone, gone through this route in the history of this country. No Nigerian president. So I don't know how Tunubu will now fight corruption with this thing that's going on. He can't. He has lost the, 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 the credibility. He has lost the, the moral stamina to fight corruption in Nigeria. That is the implication. He can't. So if you, if you understand this in the way it is, I expect him as a person, let him resign. That is the only way out. If not, he may go to jail. Though. Quote me, Tunubu may go to jail. No matter how you look, Tunubu may go to jail because of what he has done. Because there is no other way to define he has committed <laughs> an alleged criminal offense. As it is now, he's a suspect. Before not in Nigeria, before not only in Nigeria, but before the international community. The allegation against him is overwhelming. And if he continue to block every every avenue to discover the truth, he is making his case worse. Because each day he tried to cover what is already revealed. And that is what makes it embarrassing. I don't see how he can look people in the face and challenge them and fight corruption after all that has happened. It's not possible. He cannot even open his mouth and, talk, and mention corruption throughout his presidency with what is going on. So, is that not enough embarrassment? How can he condemn people for corruption with what is going on now? So, even if he doesn't want to resign, the National Assembly, I expect them to do the needful. The National Assembly should save Nigeria this embarrassment. They should not wait until this thing has become uh, unmanageable. Because as it is now, he's managing the thing that something will happen. The US court will not oblige him more. They will not too, because a lot is at stake in the United States. Yes. Um, I don't know our president anymore. We don't, this, honestly, we don't know who is leading Nigeria. We don't know our Nigeria president. Because now, according to this man, just narrated everything, everything in details. Because if you don't want a, 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 the, your school where you claimed you, you studied or you schooled or you graduated, you submitted a certificate from the school, you don't want them to release your gender. How? What are you hiding? What, what is our, what is Tinubu hiding? What is it that you're hiding that you don't want the world to know? Now, they are even begging at Kwabaka to be to forgive. This is not forgiving of it. This is politics. This is dealing with more than 200 million population. And you, you say forgive, forgive. I don't know why APC choose to choose somebody with questionable character. So many questionable character. A lot is going on that, in fact, we can't even fathom with. A lot is going on. This guy, this man, our, our president, he has so many. In fact, there's a lot unveiling. Like, you saw, I think Abaka is going to unveil the mask of our president. He's unveiling the mask, and the mask is unveiling already. That is why APC, in fact, all of them are, are, are not at peace, they are not at rest. 
because a lot are coming a lot the nigerians no be like nigeria where you feel mm -hmm. with the money you can no you can't bribe us court or you can't bribe them all because they are trying to protect their, their, their image they are trying to protect in fact everything they host on anyway what do you think on this video comment your opinion and don't forget to share